sunshines how are you all doing today hope that y'all are doing well and hope that you guys are having a really nice week this week and a nice day today and i also hope that you guys are having a nice nighttime tonight if you guys are watching this when it's nighttime i hope that your night is nice and relaxing 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 so in this asmr video I will be doing some random triggers and this is low vibe and I do have my fan blowing in the background and I really loved the way that that sounded the last time when I did that recently. It's also going to be a soft spoken a little bit but maybe a little bit of whispering as well and also a little bit of rambling as well because originally I wanted to do a whisper ramble with my Blue Yeti microphone but I only really had one topic to ramble about which I'll get into a little bit in this video. Um, because I really want to talk about it because uh, it's so cool. First, I'm going to uh, tap on this, this um, blush, this blush, blush, blush palette. Okay. <laughs> Try the side too. I got this blush at Marshalls. It's faded right here, but this is by Beauty Concept. So my cheeks are naturally rosy. It's like a genetic thing. I get it from my birth father because um, I am adopted, um, and he has natural rosy cheeks as well. But I really wanted to put on blush before doing this video, which is why I have this out anyway. Because I figured. It would make great sounds. Joining my blush a little bit, even though I do already have natural rosy cheeks. And the reason I want to put on blush is to give myself a nice sun kiss kind of look. And then I put on fake freckles as well. So I don't really, I don't really have um, a, what do you call it, like a freckle pencil type of thing. I'm not really good with makeup, guys. I normally don't wear makeup, so I don't know what the technical term for these things is but I did use this eyebrow pencil to put on the freckles so yeah but if you guys would like me to apply some freckles on you too so that way you guys can look all summery and cute 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 I will apply that on you oh and this side also has like an eyebrow um, piece to it, but anyways, I mainly only use this part, so let me get that out. Okay, so lift up here like this little bit. Trying to make a like apply the tap, 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 this is what I was originally going to ramble about if I were to do a whisper, whisper ramble. Uh, so I actually went to go see the new Indiana Jones 5 movie yesterday. Um, yesterday evening with my parents. So um, because of how I went to go see that yesterday, I'm going to tap on my DVD set for... I think that makes sense. It's hard to like trace letters for me when I'm not wearing my glasses and when it looks backwards on camera. Because I'm using my iPhone to film, so the image is reversed when I'm filming. And then, of course, when you guys see it, it's going to be normal. He is so handsome on the other side. Oh my goodness. I think this side taps better. Oh my goodness.
think I have, let's see, I um, have the fourth movie as well, but it's not part of the DVD set. By the way, I got this thrifted. You can see the thrifted price right there. Um, but I have the fourth one, which is Indiana Jones, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, but it wasn't part of this DVD set, so I have it on a separate DVD. But the ones it does come with is the bonus material right there. Oh, by the way, the fifth one was amazing. I've been a fan of Indiana Jones movies since I was 10 years old. I saw the first Indiana Jones movie, like I said, when I was 10. My parents showed it to me, my brother. I've been obsessed ever since. I recommend seeing it, by the way, the fifth one. Um, because, like, it is so good. You guys just have to check it out. I'm trying not to spoil anything if you haven't seen it yet. You know? But yeah. But this is the first one, which is Indiana Jones and the Raiders of the Lost Ark. Anyways, this one is the third movie, Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. I personally like the first one and the second one and... Maybe the fifth one too. As like a third the third one I like. And then lastly, the second movie, which is Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. But anyway, so at the movies, and this may sound gross why I kept it, but I kept it um since yesterday just so that way I could do this video. But um for a snack at the movies, I got these gummy bears by Black Forest. Um, gummy bears, so yeah. And this, oh my gosh, it still smells like the gummy bears. It smells so good. This comes with a lot of nice flavors. It smelled so good, or tasted so good. We got cherry and lemon and pineapple and orange and apple and strawberry. The flavors are listed right here. Okay. Also, I got this water bottle last night at the movies. I have not finished it yet, but like, this is a huge water bottle. Oh my goodness. So. This had, or had, I should say, because it's almost done, but it had 33.8 fluid ounces of water in here. Now, in the video, I'm going to do something really special. I got two packages in the mail from Amazon, so I'm just going to package them within this video because I think that'd be fun. Um, and I forgot to cross out my addresses, so I can't show you guys the other obviously because I forgot to cross out my address. Here's package number one. And in here is a book that I ordered. So yeah. But I don't think I want to open up that one at the moment. I'm really excited technically. This one right here, because this is a swimsuit. It's a bikini, and I'm so excited because it's so adorable. Oh my goodness, so. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna open up this one first. Um, it may sound childish with a bikini I ordered because it's, well, it's adult looking, like the style of it, but it's kind of kiddish with the print because it has dinosaurs all over it, but I just really love it. So I have my scissors right here. So. Um, yeah. Oh my goodness, guys. Look how cute this is. And it comes with a little crinkly bag. Perfect for ASMR. Okay, so Obviously I looked at the size chart before picking out what size I think would work best for me. 
Oh, by the way, this is a by brand called, if you pronounce that, but Zaful, maybe? Zaful? It's a Z there. And then an A, F, U, and L, whatever they are. Yeah, like, it has dinosaurs on it. But I told you guys, in black. And it comes with plain matching bottoms. But anyways, so I looked at the sizing chart. I got an extra large, but the extra large looked kind of small with the measurements, which is so weird because I've lost so much weight. I used to be so heavy. Like, if they had this in the 3 or 4X, I'd probably have to get this because of how big oh, I was before. I was obese. My weight has gotten so much better. Like, for example, this t-shirt I'm wearing is a small. Just to give you guys an idea of how much weight that I've lost. I'm so happy, but still. I got this in extra large, and hopefully it'll fit. So, here is the top. Oh my god, I love this. Okay, let's see if this will probably fit. Okay, it looks small because it crisscrosses in the... It crisscrosses in the back, so... Yeah. It's like a corset back. Um, let me spread it out a little bit so you guys can see. It's not a bandeau, obviously. It has straps. But, yeah, I think it should fit. I just have to widen the corset back a little bit. But this is so cute. Oh, I forgot to tap on the tag. I think that made great sounds. Okay, here we go. So, then the bottoms. Let's see what they look like. kind of cheeky in the front but this is what it looks like anyways this is what the back looks like okay anyways let me continue the video but I'm doing the last package by packaging that which again is the book where'd I put it oh yeah here it is and I have no idea where my scissors are oh here they are anyway so I forgot the name of the book I ordered it's so random like Came across this book on Amazon. It looks so interesting, so I had to get it. Okay. So, oh my gosh, this is falling. I love the smell of your books. I don't know if that sounds weird, but like the pages, they always smell so good. So this is the book right here. I should have showed you guys that first. My bad. Okay, so this is called Brave Wolf and the Lady, um, the author of the Lost Clan series by Karen Kay. So that's that. This book is about, well, I mean, it says um, to escape, sorry, to escape an arranged marriage. Mia Carlson, daughter of a U.S. senator, instead elopes with the man she loves as they are escaping her Virginia home, heading west, their wagon train is brutally attacked, leaving Mia alone in grave danger. The rescue comes from a most unlikely source, a passing of Lakota scouting party led by the darkly handsome Indian brave wolf. Although brave wolf has consented to guide Mia to the nearest trading post, he will long days on the trail lead to deep connection with the red-haired beauty yeah he can't stop wondering why death and danger stalk this beautiful woman but this says more but that's all i'm really gonna read thanks guys for watching hope you enjoyed this asmr video and i'll see you guys in um, my next video whatever that's gonna be coming up next so again thanks for watching love you sunshine so much and have a great rest of your day